St. Joseph. According to St. Teresa of Avila, St. Joseph is the patron saint of the interior life. That means to really grow in your spiritual life, your interior life, turn to St. Joseph. Never once in the Bible do we have St. Joseph speaking. He obviously spoke, but he was a man of deep prayer. He was a man that had a deep union with God the Father. St. Joseph also, and this is extraordinary, he actually taught Jesus to pray. Jesus had two natures. He had a divine nature as well as a human nature. The definition of Jesus is the Son of God made man. Therefore, Jesus had to grow in wisdom and knowledge, knowledge and grace in his human nature. So St. Joseph taught him to say, Abba, Father. St. Joseph taught him to pray, The Lord is my shepherd, there is nothing I shall want. Even though I have to walk through dark valleys, you are there with your, your rod and your staff. You anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. I believe that I will live in the house of the Lord for years to come. St. Joseph led family prayer. St. Joseph would take Mary and the child Jesus to the synagogue on every Saturday to listen to the Word of God and to praise God with, with songs and psalms. And also during the major feasts, like te the Feast of Tempico uh, Pentecost and Passover, St. Joseph would make the long trip on pilgrimage to the city of Jerusalem, taking with him Jesus and Mary. St. Joseph is a man that can teach us to pray. St. Joseph is a man that can help us to draw closer to God the Father. And St. Joseph obviously talked frequently to Jesus, Jesus being God. Therefore, when he was talking to Jesus, we can say that that is prayer. And he talked to Mary. So in our struggle, in our spiritual life, to grow in holiness, to grow deeper in our mystical life, to grow deeper in our prayer life, why not draw close to the greatest of all saints, the great St. Joseph. Good St. Joseph, Pray for us.